rebellion. You have all fought bravely and sacrificed much to bring us to this point. Yeah! But we will fight our way in and drag him out through the rubble to face justice! Because this is the end for them! The storm folks will fight like cornered rats! They will be fierce and crafty! But they are no match for legionnaires! You are the best and the brightest warriors in Tamriel! Professional soldiers! Fearless and devastating! The Emperor will be paying close attention to what happens here today. Men who distinguish themselves will be well rewarded. Secure the door. Already done, sir. Alfric Stormcloak. You are guilty of insurrection, murder of Imperial citizens, the assassination of King Torek, and high treason against the Empire. It's over. Not while I'm still breathing, it's not. Step aside, Galmar. We're here to accept Ulfric's surrender. 
I'll never surrender Skyrim into the hands of a corrupt and dying empire. Skyrim doesn't belong to you, Ulfric. No, but I belong to her. Enough! You are traitors and will die traitors' deaths. Stand down and face public execution. Or advance and face summary execution by my hands. It matters little to me. Either way, I'll be sending your heads back to Cyrodiil. Well, what are we waiting for? I'll enjoy I killing was... you! Run! Any last requests before I send you to... to wherever you people go when you die? Sovngarde, sir. Right. Well? Let the Dragonborn be the one to do it. It'll make for a better song. Song or not, I just want it done. Here. Use my sword to do it. I made sure to sharpen it for the occasion. be with you. What was that, Liggett? Nothing. Just saying goodbye. Well, the men will be expecting some kind of speech, and we'll need to hand the city over to that free winter fellow. Runwolf, yes, I've sent men to protect him and bring him here. Windhelm will need a government quickly if we are to prevent more violence. The Legion will be staying here for quite some time. I don't expect there to be any further violence. Oh, and Leggett. It's been an honor to have you at my side. As a token of my appreciation, I want you to keep my sword. And now to deliver a speech. Attention! General Tullius has an announcement. The rebellion is over. Ulfric Stormcloak is dead. His head will be sent to Cyrodiil, where it will adorn a spike on the walls of the Imperial City. Let this day be a final warning to all who would still call themselves Stormcloaks. We are turning the city over to Brunwolf Freewinter, an honorable and faithful man. Many of you will be staying in Windhelm to aid the Jarl in restoring order and stamping out any embers of rebellion that may still smolder here. In appreciation for your exemplary service, I am doubling your pay and compensation to the widows of your fallen comrades. I am proud of all of you. All hail the Emperor. All hail his legionnaires. I hate giving speeches. It wasn't so bad. I hope we haven't just created a martyr. There's bound to be resistance. There are many Stormcloak camps tucked away in the hills. They'll no doubt strike whenever and wherever they can. But without Ulfric to inflame their passions, they'll settle down and return to their homes eventually. I pray you're right, Liggett. In the meantime, we'll continue to root them out and put them to the sword. We couldn't have done this without you. The Empire glories in your accomplishments. Come, Rika. There's still much to be done. No. I suspect Skyrim to be my home for many years. I can't say I'll ever get used to the damn cold or understand these Nords, but I've come to respect them. The harshness of Skyrim has a way of carving a man down to his true self. The fiercest of the remaining rebels will continue to harass us, but by and large the people here desire peace. 
What I'm not so sure about is the peace we've made with the Thalmor. But we'll keep that between the two of us, all right? Ulfric is dead and his army destroyed. There's not much more I could ask of you. The gods, however, I suspect, may have plans for you elsewhere. That said, Stormcloak true believers are still operating out of hidden military camps in the hills. If you encounter any on your travels, kill them. With luck, they'll soon lose heart and return to their homes and families. If not, we'll be forced to put them all to the sword. Watch yourself. <laughs>